On November 3rd, an article was written by writer and insider Andy Martino for Sportsnet New York about the Mets being hesitant to outbid the Yankees for Aaron Judge, with the MLB Players Association noticing it. There's one specific part of the article written by Martino which caught the interest of the MLB Players Association, leading to them reaching out to Commissioner Rob Manfred to investigate the two New York teams and their owners. So why is this? I'm going to read the part of the article written by Martino which led to the Players Association to taking action, and then explain why there's even an issue to begin with. So here it is, quote, On April 8, the day Judge rejected the Yankees' final extension offer, Mets sources said that they did not plan to fight the Yankees this offseason for Judge. With free agency set to begin next week, that has not changed. Talking to Mets people about this all through the year, the team in Queens sees Judge as a Yankee uniquely tailored to be an icon in their uniform, stadium, and branding efforts. Owners Steve Cohen and Hal Steinbrenner enjoy a mutually respectful relationship, and do not expect to upend that with the high-profile bidding war. The only way people involved can see the Mets changing course and pursuing Judge would be if the Yankees somehow declared themselves totally out of the bidding. End quote. So there are a couple key parts to this that caught the eye of the Players Association. For one, the Mets not really looking to outbid the Yankees for Judge, and two, the biggest thing being the report in which Steve Cohen and Hal Steinbrenner have a good relationship and don't expect to try to hurt that good relationship by trying to outbid each other for the biggest name on the market. Here's why that can be an issue and why the Players Association contacted Manfred to look into illegal activity. An MLB owner having an agreement with another MLB owner not to pursue a free agent or sharing information about players is illegal collusion. As a response to the Players Association's concern and report, Major League Baseball is going to investigate the matter and reportedly going to request phone, text, email, and all forms of communication between Cohen and Steinbrenner during the period in which the two were allegedly talking about Judge. The reason why this is kind of an issue overall is because the Mets are practically having a behind closed doors agreement that they will not attempt to outbid the Yankees for Judge, meaning that takes away a team that could potentially give him money, also meaning that the amount of teams willing to give Aaron Judge money lessens. Whether the Mets are going to go hard for Judge or not, he's still going to get the bag, and there's no question about that. But it's still illegal to do what the Players Association is suspecting Cohen and Steinbrenner did, so it will be interesting to see what the investigation finds. Follow me on Instagram, let me know what you think, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.